So I guess, can you put the ice bag in the pipe? There's nothing else in there. I'm sorry you were saying. Then why did it close it? Because we had a long ass conversation. Why did it do that? Why didn't it wait until we were done checking out the freezer? Because I got chicken. Look at that bone sticking out. It's wait, it's a, that's not... What? Gross looking. Wait, what part of the chicken is that? You it's say that's wing. chicken, but chicken's normally the meat, not like... Isn't that a wing? Is that a wing? Yeah, the tips at the bottom, the bone sticking out the top is where it attaches to the chicken, I think. I don't know, let's go- let's go kill one of your chickens to see I'll if it's shaped like that. believe you, <laughs> but that doesn't look... Okay, okay but the, it wouldn't curve like that at the end. Well, maybe it just awkwardly, like, was leaning that way when it froze. Alright, so there was one more thing. I don't know if it will use it or not, but there it is. There's some frozen meat up there. Looks like pork. Huh? What's this? It looks like a tag or something. Chunk of pork! What does the tag say? Yeah. Jumpy, there's a slip of paper on that meat? I think there's something written on here, but I can't read it like this. Why not? If we try and pull it out, it'll probably rip. You needed to frost that. Oh, take all this meat to the grill. Yeah? Oh. Yeah? I don't think we're gonna be doing that in this room. <laughs> like, are you gonna read the line eventually? No. <laughs> I was like, I couldn't tell. Wait, are you gonna put a piece of paper on a grill that's gonna burn it? Oh, you just hold it over the hot spot. That's not how thawing works. Uh. You gotta put it straight in the fire. No, that's not how it works at all. It's the opposite of how it works. Have you not listened to this whole tangent no. we were just on? At, at, you most throw... you, at most, you wrap it in a wrap and put it in no. water. No. And then that helps dissipate the temperature while Keep, you're raising it. If you throw the pork directly into the fire, then you will, frozen in here. you will get new pork. It will be pork. It will be pork nine. New pork. Pork, pork nine. nine. <laughs> oh my god. So just put the fucking bag of ice in the pipe. There's, There's water dripping from this pipe. Huh. It looks like when the pipe burst, the water hit the doorknob and froze it in place. This water actually seems almost warm. Put the bag of ice in there. Probably because that entire door is probably warm compared to the room we're in right now. This freaking chicken. There's warm water flowing from the pipe. No? Okay. Hey, Junpei. Didn't you find some dry ice earlier? Yeah. There's warm water coming out of that pipe. Keith, can we not just put fucking dry ice on the pipe? Warm water and dry ice. What do you think would happen if we put that stuff in a sealed container together? Warm water flowing from this pipe. So it has to be in a sealed container. Okay, so let's check our inventory then. Knife, sturdy rope. Can, you're gonna have to combine stuff. Water bottle. Water bottle. Water bottle. There's warm water flowing from the pipe. No, combine them. Combine the dry ice and the water bottle. What? Nope. Combine the... Nope. What? Nope. Nope. What, can I thaw the... Let's no, because you, you just try, tried it. Let's try the chunk of pork on the warm water. Nope. Thought I mean, maybe you could throw the note just out. Okay. Can you, can you cut the water bottle? With the, with the, the knife? Yeah. Maybe? Can you cut the rope? Why? The rope? I don't know. Make a noose? You're not cut anything. What the fuck's the point of this knife? I don't know yet. Oh, you gotta cook the meat or the pork first. Probably. Um. Uh, so what? Water and rope? Why is this deep head like fighting me right now? I don't know. Because it's weird. DS game. Ah, dry ice. Can't you make stuff that make that stuff cause an explosion if you seal it in, in uh, something that's airtight? Explode. Oh. oh. Yeah, didn't, uh, didn't you do that in school? No, I didn't make bombs in school. Uh, you should never underestimate the power of expanding gas. Okay, so let's look for a closed container, even though I can't look in any direction besides these two You directions. have a water bottle! That's a that's an airtight container! Eh. Eh. Like, seriously, you have an airtight container. They said this, oh, this is said one. there's nothing here, right? 
They made a point to say there's nothing in there. Well, that looks airtight. What, the, the, the trap door? Yeah. I don't think that's small enough to make an explosion from pressure. Oh. Well, then anything it has to be the here? water bottle. Can you pour the water bottle out? Um... Ow. I don't know. Surprised I can't put the water content- the water up to this thing. Do I have to click specifically on the hole? Nope. What about the pipe that's coming out? There's a pipe sticking out? Is the other one's broken? Oh! I didn't even see that. Okay. Oh, there's warm water on the ground. Oh. Like, I can't even, like, click on it. What about... Weird, I did not notice that hose at all. It has to be, like, a pipe, or it has to be, like, combination. You have to combine something. Ah! What is happening with this controller? Nothing. It's perfectly fine controller. Oh, um, dang it. You're going too far. There's so many items now. Dry ice. No, because it has to be in, a, to, air, hey, has to be in an airtight container. I'm trying to see if I can add it to it. Let's oh. start by putting off the dry ice into- Why do we have to talk to them? <laughs> yeah, it's a little frustrating that you, you can't- This fucking game wants to give you so much dialogue all the time. It's a little frustrating because they're suggesting- They're suggesting like, hey, solve this puzzle. But instead of solving a puzzle, you click on a door over and over again and the other characters solve the puzzle for you. Yeah. Is what's gonna happen. Which is kind of frustrating. Alright, go ahead. Let's start off by putting the dry ice into the water bottle. But the dry ice is too big. Well, you gotta figure out a way to make it smaller then, don't you, genius? What if I combine it with knife? Really? Talk to the door again, Keith. Stop doing stuff on your own. I need to crush the dry ice if I want to get it into the bottle. Crush. I know what I'll with do. With the chicken. I'll beat it with this fucking pork. Can I scroll there or not? Where are you going? Stop. No, go that- go down. What the fu- Nothing's wrong with my controller. That was weird. It's the game okay. being bad. No, the chicken. What? Oh. There oh, goes. what? Why'd that work and not the pork? Because the pork a actually has different value. Because the pork has, a, like, the note on it. So you don't want to mess with the pork until you get the but note out of it. But they're both frozen. <laughs> it doesn't matter. What? Okay, the chicken's gone. It's crumbled? It's literally- you literally have to use the chicken for no reason other than because they want to get rid of the chicken item by you doing that. Yeah. And well, what other purpose- what are you gonna eat the chicken? You- cook? Yeah, but like, there's- the, both are obviously logical solutions because they're both just frozen meat. But only one of them works. So now combine the dry ice with the water bottle. I'm gonna put these pieces of dry ice into the water bottle. Is it just an empty water bottle? I guess so. What? <laughs> yeah. Okay. Apparently. Then tie a rope to the water bottle? So if you put the dry ice in the water bottle- oh. So you put the dry ice in the water bottle, Jumpy? If it explodes, it could probably blast away the ice on the door. So, how are we gonna get to stay against the doorknob? Rope. Rope, 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 rope. Let's just tie the rope on here. Water bottle bomb! <laughs> that escalated. <laughs> That doesn't look like a bomb. Uh, you know, you know what? Modern modern terrorism doesn't look like terrorism anymore. Surprise! You're right. It's all face acid now. Life sucks. It's so fucked. Everything sucks. All of you people suck, and you ruined it. You ruined. You, you ruined, ruined terrorism. We had a good thing going, guys, and you ruined it. There's a warm water flowing through the pipe. Put it okay. on the doorknob. You so. stupid. Put there water into the bottle with dry ice. Can I make a genuine bomb? And make sure Whoa. the lid's closed. Now I just have to put this makeshift bomb on the doorknob. Alright, that's We should set. tell Lotus to stand back from the door. So, uh, what do nah. we do now? Wait. I just need to give it a little, uh, tap. The bottle's already about to pop. If we oh. just throw a rock or something at it, it'll go off all on its own. A small rock? Huh. A small rock. We're in a freezer, you idiot. Just throw June at it. <laughs> All right, this ought to do the trick. What is that? Dry ice. Icebergs? <laughs> oh no, the Titanic! <laughs> ah, some dry ice, huh? Not a bad idea. Wait, shouldn't right, you guys, not touch dry ice with back. your bare hands? Actually, we should probably hide somewhere. I've heard it's not a great idea, but I don't know if I've ever heard why. Because it, like, it's literally so cold that it will, like, 
burn your fingers? I don't really know. Where exactly do you expect us to hide, genius? Uh, in go the inside, cupboard? Go inside that one cupboard, yeah. There's like a bunch of space in it. One of us can hide underground. <laughs> they can, in the trap Well, door. no. Th them two are going to have to hide in the freezer. We'll hide underground because we can still get a position on the bottle, throw it, and go down. Yeah. There isn't really anywhere big enough. Yeah, there is. Look, right here. We can hide in there. Wait, Come on, all the way Oh, it's that big? Quick. That thing's huge. And there was only just a water bottle right. and something else inside? Here I go. And we reached all the way down to the bottom for it? Yeah. I guess we had to just jump in to do it. Three, four, five. You're counting the wrong way. Oh, oops. <laughs> what? Is that a real joke in this game? What, what the fuck? Wait, what? <laughs> Wait, I, I just got lost here. What? What? He can't. He his count. He counted up, and somehow everybody's like, "How? Are, why are you doing that?" Well, just I mean, I am in control of the door. I'll count whatever the fuck. On way one I feel hand, like. yeah, but also like, what? Well, why? How is he counting the wrong way? And how is that a real joke in this game? That is a really sad excuse for a joke, man. Sorry, dude. Is this game making bad jokes than making fun of its own bad? Yes, jokes? it's very meta, Keith. You don't Weird. understand. You don't understand the humor of zero. We're having escape. some weird moments today. Just All this right, route. For real this time. You guys ready? Yes, whenever you're ready. Just throw the damn thing. Let's joke about right, freezing to death. Here I go. Three, two, Whoa. one. Oh my god, is that a flashbang or a bomb? Jumpy! The ice on the door! Is it gone? Yeah, it's gone! What? The blast must have shattered it. Yes! All right, let's see if it opens. How was that a better solution than just using a knife? Shut up. <laughs> they had a knife the whole time. Shut up. You never scraped ice off your windshield before? Shut up. When I scrape ice off my windshield, I make a makeshift ice bomb and fucking get arrested. <laughs> Yo, that's how you get ice off your windshield before you go to work. Yeah, makeshift bombs. You don't just have dry ice, a water bottle, rope, and hot water hanging around all the time? Yeah, of course. As opposed to like a scraper. <laughs> or as opposed to just taking Hooray, the warm water and mel melting the ice. Yatta! Move! Whoa. Oh, god damn it! Ha, da, 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 da. Fuck! Why did you do that? Why did you. Why did you touch that? You ran across. You, you had to run across the entire kitchen to get to that hot surface. Did you just think you were going to touch it with your hands? I guess. Well, you did just grab the grill. What did you think would happen? Hey, where's Lotus? Oh, uh, welcome back. I was starting to get tired of waiting for you guys. What were you doing? What do you mean, what was I doing? I was waiting. We were going to die! Oh, yeah? But you didn't. So everything worked out all right, didn't it? What the hell? <laughs> Just kidding. It might not look like it, but I was really worried. Oh, don't give me that crap. Uh, I'm telling the truth. I mean, if you died, then I'd be in trouble too. If you died, then I'd be stuck here, and I'd die too. See? Uh. I did all I could. I even looked around to see if there was anything I could use to pry open the door. But I couldn't find anything. So, all I could do was wait. I mean, what else did you want me to do? Call the cops? Fine. But there's one thing I have to ask you. What's that? You didn't close the door, did you? Wait, what? You think I closed the door on you? Why would I do something like that? It closed on its own. I told you before, if you die, then I die too. Yeah, I guess so. If she really wanted to kill us, all she had to do was bar the door from the outside. But she didn't. Well, she didn't do anything. Couldn't she have, like, tied the knob so that it would be in the open orientation and then just, like, ram the door? And yes. then it would open? <laughs> yeah. Because it opened towards us, right? Yeah. So, like, you just have to, like, put it in the on position and then just hit it real hard. It's like the ice. Even if... Okay, but the here... The ice is only in one spot. Here you go, Keith. Even if she did that, it doesn't matter what side the door opens from because there's three people on one side and her on the other side. 
Even just Both hitting it hard could, would crack the ice yeah. so it's not, not a seal anymore. Because, like, that only works if she couldn't actually get... Like, if the door opened only from pulling her way, that would only make sense. Like, she couldn't do that. what you're saying if there wasn't anybody on the inside. But we were on the inside. If she just held the door open and me and Santa kicked at it, it should open. <laughs> Dex her in the face. I don't give a fuck about her. I, I am amused that her skimpy clothes became a plot device because it meant that she didn't want to stay in the freezer for two seconds and then got stuck on the outside. On the outside? Around on the, the outside. outside. She's only lazy, or negligent at least. Not an attempted murderer. I mean, it sounds like a good mother. Well, I'm, I'm sorry. I'm sorry I doubted you. Hmm? Oh, yes, well that's alright. As long as you understand. Hey, no more screwing around, you two! Why is it- Why is it a number two? Yeah. Break time's over. Especially for you, lady. You've just been sitting on that fat ass of yours while we were freezing to death. Damn! Everyone calls her I, fat and old, and it just seems so- I don't think anybody calls her it? fat. I think people just no, call her old. Santa does now. Well, Santa he, called him fat, and everyone else calls her old. I'm like, she, this well, is get, It's this a like, fat ass. It's starting, I mean, to get, she, starting to get mean. She probably does got a fat ass. Yeah. She got big old titties, How big old fat rude. ass. I was plenty busy. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> How about you put all that energy into something besides bitching? Let's go. We're out here, still here. It's not over yet. We're still so put your put your pork on here. the grill, which probably gives us the combination for the lock, lock yes. we have here. It better because we haven't made a lot of other progress. Guess I put this meat on the grill. Hey, what are you doing? Uh... What are you gonna do if the paper burns? Uh, come on, it'll be fine. I mean, it's not like it's gonna burn right away, all right? We just gotta keep an eye on it, and the paper will be fine. Well, they can argue all they want. I'm gonna keep an eye on this pork. Hey, you can just keep an eye on it and just grab it if anything yeah. starts to happen. I'm gonna try to take the paper out. It looks like it's about time. Jumpy, be careful. We'd have heard a care, but I know what I'm... Ow! See? I told you. Hey, what the hell are you doing? Hurry up and take the paper out. If only we had like a knife we could use to carefully like uh, push the paper away from the grill so we could pick it up safely. It's not coming out. This thing's frozen stiff. I can't get it out. So, are we gonna have to cut the meat? Uh... Yeah, it looks that way. Makes sense, because you cut in smaller portions because it's cooking from the outside. Alright, now that I've sharpened the knife... Yes! I cut the pork! Awesome, Junpei. Now we can cut out the paper. Awesome, Junpei. You're my hero. C plus 10 plus F. So what? That's... There we go. So that's 13, 10, oh wait, 13, 16, 15? 15? Yeah. Because F is 15, 10 is 10 16. Is 16. C, is, uh, C is 13. A is 10, right? A is 11, B is 12, C is 13. A is 11? Yes. What's 10? Oh wait, no, A is 10. A is 10. Shit. A, B, so 12. <laughs> yeah. Ba -da -da. So it's C plus 10 plus 15. So 12 so plus 15 plus 16. 12, 12, 16, 15. So that's 27 and then... Oh. So that's 43. Cannot keep shit straight in this oh, game. It's 43, there we go. right? They are pluses. They are yeah, all pluses. They're all pluses. So yeah, 43. Oh. It doesn't matter, just go put the- just go press the fucking thing yeah. and it's gonna do it automatically anyways. Oh god, will it really? Probably. That'd be so frustrating. The 16, 12, that's 28 plus that 43. Ba -da -da -da. Only a two-digit code? This probably is what you're supposed to use to enter the password. Uh, Maybe if I put in the right number, it'll open the oven door. Junpei, maybe that note you found earlier... Yeah. I know. Do you know how to enter those numbers, uh... 
I think E is for enter and C is for clearing. Uh, so basically, when I'm ready to submit my answer, I press E. So if I screw up, I just press C, right? We're literally, we're literally repeating the instructions. <laughs> All right, let's give it a shot. I literally didn't need instructions, but they said them multiple times. Ah, uh, sounds like metal is falling. Well, I guess that went well. Yeah, the door opened. Good job, Jumpy. It's the Saturn key card that we saw later in the other storylines. It's purple and shit. Ta-da. Looks like a lowercase h, but the uh, lines excuse me. throwing Shut me off. Shut your fucking whore mouth. This is a symbol for Saturn. That was uh, Santa's line that oh. you just read. Well, fucking, it makes no sense everyone's talking when I'm doing the inspection screen. Remember? There was an elevator next to the main staircase. <laughs> it really bothers me that I pressed the inspect button on this private menu that's inside my brain, and people freaking talk to me in it. Yeah. Wasn't there a mark like this on the card reader next to it? So, oh yeah, I remember that. I guess that means the card ain't gonna help us to get out of this room then. I'm not so sure. Why don't we try it out? I know one yeah, thing. Yeah, Junpei, stop talking to yourself and fucking try yeah, stuff. We have nothing else to try, so let's do this. Escape. Yes. Yes, I think it's unlocked now. You did it, Jumpy. Uh, you said this like four times now. Yeah, that's all she does is let's get out of support here. us. She's a fucking cheerleader and I don't need it. Did she help us at all? No. Did she? Was her, Was the bomb her idea? No. I don't remember who the, whose idea she, of the bomb was. Everyone has to contribute, right? No, I don't think that's what that means. I can never tell what the fuck that part means, yeah. I yes! Think a, I think Let's a go! I think a tribute means they, like, they have to... Oh. They have to, uh... Like, go... They have to work together. You found it. It always looks like... Technically, Lotus did literally nothing except explain... I think... Uh, we've been the, here before. What's it called? Um, base 10 to us. That's helping. She explains hex to us. Although it's very, 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 very frustrating that there's an entire table dedicated to stacks of dishes that are in different orders and counts, and there's like a note referring to them, and none of that is a puzzle you solve. Yeah. <laughs> well, that was so baffling. The elevators are over there, so that means... We went into the kitchen through that door and came out on this side. That means the map was right! Looks like. Then let's use it to plan our next move. Next move? Yeah, we need to decide where to go from here, don't we? He's right. Let's get started. From the looks of it, there are four possible routes. Let's just keep it simple and call them A, B, C, and D. First, A and B. They both seem to connect to a room that looks L-shaped. Yeah, there were two doors. But they were both locked. We couldn't open them. Now, Route C. This goes all the way to the main staircase. That means it's door 5, one of the numbered doors. Then do you think we would meet up with the other four after this hallway? No, I don't think we will. Why not? Look, there by the stairs. See how the gate is opened? When we went into the kitchen, it was closed. But it's open now. What do you think that means? They opened it. Most likely. And if we take Route C, we're going backwards. That would be pointless. Then that means... Route D, then. D it is. Yep, Route D. Then we're set. We're all getting the D. Yeah. So that's the gate we opened when we were Everything seven. Everything looks okay yeah. here. Let's check the next deck just to be sure. Yeah, just like I thought, D deck is totally underwater. Just like the bottom of the central staircase. At least the water level hasn't really changed. Small comfort. May as well head back to C deck. Hmm, what else is here? There are two elevators over there at the top of the stairs, just like the floor above. Hold on, these are kind of different. See? There's a card reader on the side. 
Another strange mark. Hey, look, it's Lotus's symbol. The same joke, but now she's here. <laughs> oh my god. Junpei, are you serious right now? Huh? See, it's the woman symbol with horns on it. That seems like. Oh, ouch, 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 ouch. Yay, the anime trope where women can be violent for free whenever someone says something rude. What was that about the mark again? Uh, uh nothing. <laughs> nothing, you fucking weird abuser. Why are you fucking so violent? Why did you just assault a man? It'd only be more tropey if the top half of her face was now black and she had two plus signs for eyes. And then maybe like a weird D-shaped mouth that had like a corner of it that was like, ah. What? Okay. I've seen a lot of angry women in anime. <laughs> you said something this about me, now I'll hit you. This is a symbol. The horns symbolize the wings on Hermes' staff. Hermes herpes, whatever. <laughs> <laughs> what the fuck? Okay. Uh, no, that's not how- I'm gonna just be randomly dismissive about everything we need in order to survive. I mean, that's not even about what we need to survive, that's like randomly dismissive about something no one even said. Like, do we mention herpes? She just said Hermes' is death. Yeah, but why'd he say herpes? Whatever. He's- because- because he's making- he's like- they, it's like tomato- he's like, a uh, something shmump. It's not a tomato-tomato thing, no, it's, it's Hermes like, and herpes! <laughs> it's like something shmump thing or whatever, like, just like, dismissive, like, mispronunciation of just fuck this thing. For some reason. <laughs> Why herpes? I don't- because it's the one letter off. That's the- that's the point. There's, Herp, there's herpes. such two different things, it's ridiculous. Yeah, but the, the, the second word- what the second word is doesn't matter, he's just like, eh, is what he's doing, basically. Yeah. He's just making noise. It just seems weird to be like, it's the, her the symbol of herpes, whatever, is like, <laughs> what? Have you seen a symbol for herpes? Because, like... If we can't get this thing to work, these elevators aren't going anywhere. In other words, we need a key card with the Mercury symbol on it. Probably. I guess we can't get on, then. Let's just disregard the elevators for now. How about this hallway on the left? Well... There's so many doors. Damn it. If we try and search all these, the sun's gonna go down before we've done half of them. Isn't the sun already down? Yes. It's a nine hour thing. It ends at six, so it started at 9 p.m. So it was, the sun was already down. Yes. But they can't see what's up, what time it is outside. They're just believing a clock. Yeah. But still, like, a weird, inaccurate expression. It should be, uh, we wouldn't be able to finish set. these all until the sun came out. Oh, up. there goes June. <laughs> I have a feeling this ship is the only thing that's going to be going down anytime soon. That's Maybe even June worse. might be. Well, we can come back to this hallway later. You go back to the elevator joke? With June, really? Yes. That was like four or five hours ago in this playthrough. That was a little bit more than four hours ago. It was ago. a while ago. Jeez, this is actually a really long playthrough. <laughs> Let's check the hallway on the other side, shall we? <sighs> Time to head back to the stairs. And now the right hallway. Uh, there are doors here too. Uh, well, I guess it's just four this time. Let's open them. All right. Let's start with this one. Like I said that, but I think like this is actually literally the hot longest I've ever, the furthest I've ever been to a playthrough before airing a single episode of it. We're really far into this, and then we already aired on other once. channels. Yeah, but we're like, like. 10 plus hours in now, I think. Yeah. Jesus. Uh, That's a new experience. Huh. It isn't locked. I'm going to open it. Why? This is a familiar location. What, what the hell is this? This place is huge! Oh, there are beds everywhere. Is... is this a hospital? It definitely has the smell. Could be. I see medicine cabinets and surgical tools. Hey, look there. The four doors at the end. The left door says three. The second door is blank, but the third has a seven. And the rightmost door is eight. There's no doubt, they're numbered doors. 
Why is the second door blank? That seems kind of strange, don't you think? That's like his catchphrase at this point. Yeah. <laughs> that seems kind of strange, don't you think? Seems kind of weird. Damn straight. Damn straight. <laughs> that seems kind of strange, don't you think? It's the Santa remix. <laughs> remix. <laughs> God. God. I Really high on this redundant dialogue, though. It's like, there's no doubt about it. There are numbered doors. After I just pointed out the number on all three doors. I'm like, what? No point worrying about it right now. Let's see if these will open first. Yes, you mean, that sounds like a good plan. If one of them will open first. Yeah, remember to try them all. Do they people o keep trying They always try open. the doors, just in case. Oh, it's no use. Take this. <laughs> I got you. I got you with that one. <laughs> That's a Sonic 06 reference. Well, of course. If it was that easy to open these doors, what would be the point of the nonary game? I don't know, it'd be fun to catch uh, Zero fucking up. <laughs> Just like, forgot to lock that door. Welp! <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Everything's a wash. <laughs> Somebody just opens the door, he's like, uh, I guess I'll just turn all of your bracelets on. All of you find the dead. <laughs> like one of the things that comes to mind is like whenever I'm in a real escape room, I always have this moment of like, what if one thing's slightly out of place or missing and the entire thing is undoable? Like, that's a fear I have, is, like, that ruins the whole escape room. But it's a lot scarier if that thing could happen when you, um, uh, die if you lose. Well, I feel <laughs> like... like... If one thing is slightly out of place, you, like, awkwardly, like, uh, don't mind me, I'm just gonna fix the puzzle real quick. Let's go over there, just look the other way. <laughs> Stop, no, don't touch it, it's broken. <laughs> Pay no attention to the man behind the broke-ass shit. <laughs> We I'm have to here. activate the red, or the numbered doors won't... Wait a minute. What's wrong? Look, the display on the red. There's nothing on it. Huh? Don't you remember? The red at the central staircase? If no one I was inside, it's vacant. Where they meet each other again. Oh, yeah. yeah you're there's right. a lot of redundant but stuff that's gonna happen here, because they're just discussing the reds. There's nothing on... Right. No one? Only... We just gotta... Yeah, they're gonna be like, let's try them all! I, I gotta skip some of this. It's just... It's the exact explanation we did before, where they try the doors. Just with more people now. Yes, with more and people. Zero. Where's no, everyone else? Maybe. Where's it? I that? believe the bottom of the device yes. has been removed. Snake. 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 Ace. Clover. Seven. How? How did you guys? How did you end up here? That's my line. Do you have to know? Well. You don't watch dubbed stuff too often, though, huh? What? The anime. No. Like, I was just wondering if you would recognize Ace's voice actor, because I feel like I have to know it. Like, surely I've heard it several times before. You probably have. Although, technically, anime voice actors for, like, dubbed anime voice actors are also the same people that dub just English cartoons. There's, you're gonna, like, the pool for voice actors in America is way smaller than Japan. Yeah. He... <sighs> I wonder if he played one of the versions of Beast. He sounds like a voice actor that would play Beast, like McCoy? Maybe. He probably played McCoy in one of the X-Men shows. Perhaps we should exchange information. It's actually the guy who did the voice for Robot Robotnik from the old <laughs> there 90s you have. song. <laughs> the I'll for the story. Okay, let me see if I got all this straight. When you guys got here, the bases for the Reds were already gone. And you looked all over this room, but you couldn't find anything. So you figured that there might be something in the hallway with all the doors. So you went and had a look? Yeah. And while you were looking around, you heard voices. Uh-huh. So you followed the voices and came back here. Indeed. And that was how we found you. Why don't we check those three reds again, just in case? You're right. Huh. There's a long, thin gap on the bottom. I think it's a slot for... I gotta start skipping again. Well, if the... <laughs> well isn't... Because now we're just no, talking no. about the same reds again. Possibly. Yes. Although it might be there time was... to stop for this there... branch. I was able yeah. to get a good... Yeah, they're uh, talking about doors. Yeah, we've been we've been I mean, to this entire conversation before. Well, the gigantic... All right, so I think that's... Yeah, now we're talking about the gigantic... Yeah, yeah we're okay. out. We're out. Yep. All right, so we, we finished the branch, kind of, mostly. I mean, it's... I doubt something illuminating happens in the next few minutes because it's like the same conversations again. So it's, I think we well, finished this gigantic. alternate branch. 
So next, we'll check out these other branches, and then we'll press forward into uncharted territory. Spooky! And well, one know? of them seems easy. Oh, one, one of them has, like, one missing escape room, it looks like. Well, no, one is just, like, you, you go down the on the left path, and then you make another left choice. It's like, well, there's your ending right there. So there's, like, well, apparently one choice you make is, like, okay, done. Story's over. Like, you don't have to do oh, much. Oh, like, there's one less step. Yeah, then the other one's just like, uh, let me tell you about some stuff. And then it's like, okay, Could now be. it's over. Could be. Who done it? It might All be. Right. That, it might be that there's no novel. It might just. You, I think it's just the ending. Yeah. You, might you, you might. you might just pick a direction and then it just ends right there, or you yeah. pick the other direction and then story happens, then it ends. Yeah. Because yeah, there's like the the submarine is its own node, and the novels are on their own no, no nodes, and the escapes are their own nodes. But you never have multiple novels in a row unless they're unless it's at a junction. Yes. Yeah. So it only does multiple novels in a row when there's a junction happening. So that means that if there's multiple things in a row there. Either there's a really brief escape room followed by an ending, or it's novel leading to an ending, or just an ending between the two. All right, next time. Next time. <laughs>